What is up guys, my name's Ali A. I'm here today at Tomlin's Coat School with City and Guilds for the Open Doors campaign. Soccer Coaching Limited work with this school and others to run apprenticeships for those looking to work in sport. I'm here to find out how an apprenticeship in sport can be the first step to a great career. Nice to meet you, man. Sweet. Hi, Charlie. Awesome. Justin. Nice to meet you, dude. Hi, Pete. Awesome. So what's your role here at SEL? As an apprentice, I support coaches in their lessons. It's mainly assisting at the moment, but as the year goes on, we want to progress um, and we want to be leading the sessions on our own. So what do your parents think about you doing an apprenticeship? Well, my parents felt that it was a good platform into the career I want to go into. So what has the apprenticeship done for you personally in terms of your confidence? I think it's improved my confidence massively. Um, I used to shy away from things a lot, but I think as a coach, you need to be confident. Um, and obviously with the apprenticeship, it gives you a good year to sort of build up that confidence and become a better coach. All right, man, what's going on here? Uh, at the minute, we are just doing a standard Alamo session. They're going to dribble the ball into me. Yeah. Passing it back to them, they're going to take a touch or just hit it with their weak foot. Weak take foot? A yeah, take a strike and go. Okay. So you can take a shot anywhere. Yes. <laughs> oh, boys! <laughs> Showing the skills. So why did you decide to do an apprenticeship? I decided to do an apprenticeship because I like coaching, I like football, I like to take my own plans into my own sessions and it's something I want to do in the future. So far it's showed me techniques, how to take on sessions, uh, it's building up confidence because week in week out I'm taking my own sessions with my assistant. With the apprenticeship I've been assisting other coaches and I've been able to learn off them, learn different coaching styles, then like, boost my own confidence, boost my own coaching ability. What do you hope to do in the future after your apprenticeship? I'd like to join a football team off the camp, become an assistant there and gradually build up in the club. Marcus, what's your role here at SCL? Uh, my role is as Operations Director of SCL. What would you say to someone thinking of doing an apprenticeship? I would say it's a great idea. It gives you working experience of how to do the job, technical knowledge and also literacy and numeracy skills that set you up for life. A lot of these guys behind us today set out wanting to be footballers but quite often that doesn't work out for them, so they have to have a plan B, and quite often that can be sports coaching or leisure related. So what's involved in an apprenticeship at SEL? We start off doing maths and English skills for them to develop the literacy and numeracy skills. We then move into more technical elements. As a sports coach, it's important that you understand how to deliver sports sessions. You've got to have a, an experience of fitness, an experience of nutrition, and you've got to be able to transfer that across to young learners. Nice to meet you, man. I'm Ali. Thanks, well, nice to meet you. Lift. I, sh I should have taken the lift up the stairs. <laughs> do you want to come see the classroom? Let's do it. So what's your role here at SEL? Well, I'm a regional manager, so I look after 12 foot clubs where we have apprentices running and also members of staff within that that have obviously have kids connected to that as well. How did you get into your role working here? I actually started on the apprenticeship programme. It was an opportunity for me to actually share my passion for sports alongside on the job experience, which has been brilliant in kind of helping me progress on to where I've gone. So what did your parents think about you taking the apprenticeship? Yeah, I think my parents kind of gave me the, the, the choice of it. I mean, I think a lot of people get bogged down necessarily like university, um, where I think apprenticeships are uh, kind of a new opportunity. I mean, my parents did apprenticeships when they were kids, so kind of something that's coming back now that gains opportunities, so it's actually on the work experience rather than just reading about it in a book. So I think it's really beneficial. Black. Ali, come up. Thank you, thank you. Well done. Cheers. Whew, that has been a load of fun. I have learnt loads of skills today. Maybe showed off some skills, I don't know. There's so much that goes into sport coaching. Fitness, health, technique, and I can see how taking a sports apprenticeship could lead to an interesting and fulfilling career. And of course, guys, don't forget to subscribe and check out more videos right here on the City and Guilds YouTube channel.